Hi everyone, welcome back to Enough is Enough. Ace of Pirate back with you again today and we are back with the Vertical series. This time we're going to be taking a look at Villa for you and this is rammed full of soft floors and opportunities for those vertical kills. So stick around and I will go over all the spots that you need to have an absolute field day. Just before we jump into the action quickly, I want to give a shout out to a young guy called Kenzie. He's a big fan of the channel and he gives us a lot of support and we really appreciate it. Thanks a lot for that. Now without further ado, let's get into those vertical spots for you. Looking at attack first. Number one on the list for you then is the vault area. It's how to attack it from underneath. So with Book just outside the piano room there, you're in the corner of the hallway and you can get yourself a nice view you, you can see the weapons now that is the middle of the room so that's not bad you're going to get people rotating to look at the doorways and moving through but if you come a couple of boards over there I can just take a couple of holes out and you can see the wall that people like to perch themselves against just to shoot through that vault door and then there's a soft wall that you can move quickly through into the gallery area here and again if you take out all of this ceiling it's a bit more sheltered so you're less likely to be attacked by those roamers and it just gets you over to that left hand wall now this can also be useful if I just put a shot up there you're going to see that's the soft wall that's usually reinforced and that's very useful for clearing bandits and whatnot off there as well so that's a great way to get a cheap kill in the vault area. Next up, we find ourselves in Piano Room, and we're just going to blow through that panel. It's the second full panel there, and what that's going to give you access to is the mirror spot in the Aviator Room. So if you're trying to attack from Balcony, get one of you underneath here and get that mirror shot out. Now, as you know, a lot of people tend to play those mirrors on two of the walls, so we're going to look at how to get the second one. So if you come into the library, I think it's the southeast corner, you can blow out all around that chandelier there, and you can see exactly where the rotation will be between the two rooms the aviator and the bar and you can also pop the mirror there you can get up into the corner that they like to hide in behind bar it's a really powerful spot is that one so a useful one to get yourself into another spot in library now if I blow away first you're gonna see the corridor that is outside of the bar area so you're looking um, at an aviator hold again and now if you shoot out the third from the left you can get a nice angle in that's the corner behind pool table and people like to just crouch in there and wait for people moving in through that door so that's another good one Next up, we are looking at how to deal with telescope room now. Quite often, you'll get somebody hiding in the back corner of telescope room, and they're just looking for anybody trying to approach through bathroom. This is onto a trophy hold, so quite often they'll sit in there, but if you just get yourself again into the uh, the corner of the corridor underneath there, where the stairs are that lead up, you can shoot that out and get up above them. And uh, There's another useful spot just down the corridor in front of the grandfather clock. If you shoot that out, you can get in between with this second board from the wall you can get in between there's a flight case and I think it's a, a, a bookcase or something similar in the objective room of trophy and again that's another common hiding spot for anybody trying to anchor in the objective so that's a good way to get them out of there Next up then, if we start taking out the floor in Memorial, you can see we just get another good view into the second objective room of that trophy location. And if the, this is where you'll see where we're looking now. You can see that mural on that back wall. So there's a big back wall with a full painted mural. You can get excellent views from Memorial of that entire room. And again, it's another common one to try and rotate through to move from one side to the other. Or alternatively, if you get challenged in Master, people will move into this room sometimes to sort of get away from that so again have somebody underneath and ready prepared just to take them out Next up, we find ourselves down in Kitchen. This can be a good one to use because I've found the Romas don't tend to use Kitchen too heavily. Um, and it's actually underneath Bathroom. So you can see if you go too far there, you'll hit the concrete floor. But otherwise, you can just shoot out above the uh, the island in the kitchen. You can just shoot out all this floor here. You can see the bathroom window there. If we take another section of that out, you can see all the way to the door that leads through to Master. And I love to play in Bathroom myself. It's somewhere I like to hang it's a great place to challenge them coming into master so again you're gonna have some success with that one I'm sure now looking at it from the flip side if we are on a kitchen objective you can get yourself up to kit up to bathroom sorry and get some great angles down a 
good one here is just underneath the window you can see down into that corner that's just behind the doorway there um, and you can see the double door as well now I'm also going to show you in a second if you just uh, shoot out another couple of those you can get a good view onto that double door for the rotation and if you come out of bathroom just under the single window in the telescope room you can get an excellent view down into one of the most popular hiding corners on kitchen there's no soft wall around this it's it's a real spot to wedge yourself into as a defender so just shooting out the floor there underneath the single window that's going to get you a great view down there get some nades in and you're going to get an easy kill there as well so next spot that we've got caesar's in telescope room again and it's just in the double door just uh, around the rug here once I get a couple uh, a couple more shots and you'll get a better view of what I'm looking at um, but again it's just working into that kitchen area and it's giving you a good view onto the double door that's often used for rotation and then there's another corner there that people like to hide in it's just opposite the single door they can get themselves some cover from the kitchen unit and you can uh, just sort of maintain a firefight there for quite a while so just get upstairs get into the telescope room and you can get that blown out no problem at all next up then we will move on to our defensive spots so the first one sees us in laundry and we are looking at how to defend master from below so master bedroom is super popular for attackers to try and push through on a trophy objective so you've got uh, the far corner underneath the hatch will get you one of the windows and then the second corner opposite there will get you the other window so you can watch both of those for entries and again believe me people are not looking down when they're coming through there now also there's master closet which is uh, particularly popular so if you move yourself through into the dining room you can get these couple of panels blown out and again you can see straight up there towards that single door so you can't stop people getting into the closet but generally speaking they don't want to breach into bathroom they'll come through the single door into master so again easy kills as they come through your guns just going to bounce onto their head there I guarantee moving on to the final defensive spot for you then we are going to look at how to defend the tricky balcony area for the aviator push so the first one you can see we are just outside of the art room here and we're going to look up through to the door that leads on to balcony so that's probably the most popular attacking point you have to be patient and wait for them to try and move inside the building to get them from there um, but you certainly will do if we move into the room itself then the art room underneath we can get that second board in from the left near the single door out of there and you can see the single window that also leads into the room adjoining aviator looking to the flip side of that room now you can see that's the single door that i'm talking about initially you're going to have your mirror set up on that wall and you will get a balcony push more often than not but another real danger point is this north side door they like to come in through that single window or possibly up these stairs and here is a way to deal with it you can get yourself downstairs and just open up the floor there's another single window there so it's a handy little uh, notice of exactly where it is you need to shoot out but you can see there the single door that leads into aviator from the north you can see the single window next to it people like to try and get an angle all the way in through the window and then if you sort of press yourself hard against the wall opposite as now and look back then you can see the double door as well at the top of stairs where they tend to sort of float around in that area trying to get an angle deep into the site if I just run back up the stairs you're going to see what I mean so people like to stand around here and see what angles they can get in see if they can get at that mirror from behind so that's everything that we've got for you on Villa today hopefully it's going to be useful you're going to be able to just use that verticality a little more. I've focused around two of the objectives massively because you will find that 90% of your time on Villa is spent playing against the trophy room or an aviator objective or defending one of those two. So they really are the useful sites to remember these vertical options for getting clear out the roamers and then start really gunning that floor out from underneath people and go to town. As always, we'd like to thank you for your time in watching. Hopefully you've seen something Thing that's going to help stop you being that easy kill and say enough is enough if you have then make sure to hit like hit subscribe and come back there'll be plenty more coming from us soon we'll see you next time